What is up, my beautiful people? Welcome back to another video with your girl, Pamela Janani. Welcome back to my channel. What is the vibe, my beautiful tribe? Happy Thursday. If you guys are not subscribed, please go ahead and do so right now. Support your girl on this journey that I always say is going to be because it absolutely is, darling, let's go. So, you mess with God's children and it's a, oh, it's an ouch for me. It's a, it's an ouch. Sometimes we may fall, we may hurt ourselves and, and, and we don't feel that sting until later on or we need a couple minutes. And this is, what ha what is what's happening to a lot of the people who has hurt God's children. And you could be thinking like, well, Pamela, you know, are you talking about me or you? No, I'm talking about the innocent children out there. The babies who have been gaslighted, hurted, manipulated, whose narrative was trying to be controlled by someone else, an adult. Let's tap into it. This is for the kids, the babies. Mess with God's children and it's an ouch. Mess with the innocent children. It's a big ouch. When you're trying to hurt an innocent soul, a baby, a baby, birth up until what, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, a baby, innocent children, a child, it's a big ouch. It's a big ouch. Someone who hasn't done anything to you, but you wanted to pretend like the the because the person that they're attached to, which 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 you which you you lied on that person, you, you wanted to pretend like because that person is not for you, then the child is not for you. And this could be family, this could be your baby daddy, your baby mom. This you you're hurting a child, and you want to believe that God is going to let you come in front of him and say that, well, you know, the mom or or the sister or somebody that is connected to that child is the reason why I'm mistreating that child. You want to say what? It's a big ouch. Let's tap into it tomorrow. You don't hurt anybody more than God when you hurt an innocent child. God gives us choices. You make the right one or you don't. You listen to false people or you don't. But karma is like a sting. It's going to sting a lot of people who are hurting children and putting a band-aid on it. It's going to sting real hard. It's going to get real bloody in the spiritual when you do such things like that. Let's tap into it some more. Each person who hurts the innocent are attacked. The sting of misery, a sting of being haunted. Karma that can't be reversed, only paid. People out here who are hurting innocent children, thinking it's okay to abandon children, thinking it's okay to leave children, thinking it's okay to do anything to a child, molestation, anything. These people are going to pay karma in any way that God sees fit. If you have any children who has been hurt, poorly mistreated, on purpose, on purpose, uh, not, not protected, on purpose, this person, these people who are doing it will pay. They will pay with their life. They will pay with their soul. God says they are going to pay. They're going to pay. A lot of people abandon children and leave children because they saw or heard that their Uncle Joe did it. Their dad did it. And so if they're living and it's okay. But I guarantee you they're attached to H-E double hockey stick. And they don't even tell you. Or you saw it, but you just figured that you can handle it too. Well, let me tell you, there's certain people that you don't cross who those kids are connected to. And when you do that, whatever you saw your uncle or your daddy go through, trust me when I say it gets worse. Because you're messing with somebody who's anointed. You're messing with a child who's connected and who's also anointed. You mess and are messing with the wrong tribe. So what you saw your daddy go through, what you saw your uncle go through, it's not the same thing as what you will go through. They will go through. Let's tap into it some more. What awaits these people is a heavy contribution to Satan's home. These people are going to contributing themselves to Satan's home when they pay for what they have done to innocent children. What they continue to do to innocent children. As I said before in the beginning, God says, I gave you a choice. I gave you a choice to make things right. Did you do it? But God says, all these people who commit sins, they want God to be there when they need him. They want God to bless them with a job. They want God to bless them with a new child. They want God to bless them with a happy marriage. They want God to bless them when they are not blessing someone that they need to be blessing. Their own child, their own children, or anybody that they have decided to neglect 
and, and abused in any way, shape, or form. Let's go. Innocent children have nothing to do with anybody. Nobody. Nobody. Stop trying to put um, excuses on what you do. Stop. Because let me tell you that the people that are next to you that are saying, okay, you're doing the right thing, those people are not going to be attached to the misery that God is going to put you in. They're going to get their own, but they're not going to get, they're not going to be able to save you from what God has planned for you and your sin. False or not, the people that we, uh, that, 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 that these people have attached themselves to, false or not, we have a choice. People need to understand that we have choices to make. You make the right ones or you make the wrong ones. You make the wrong ones and then you ask God how to make it right and you make it right. And people who are not making it right when they know that they should, there's something that awaits for you that you won't be able to handle, that the people around you won't be able to save you from. Because they'll be going through their own. Do you get what I'm saying? That is it for this video. I love you guys so much. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Share your girl's content. Get your girl past 5K, 10K, 100,000, 100, and so much more. God names needs to go viral. His people's name needs to go viral. This is God's world. I am taking it back. You are taking it back. We are building his kingdom one day at a time. Love and light, guys. Bye.